Good morning. Welcome to BN News. I'm CC. A free outdoor music festival took place on Saturday at the newly built West Kowloon Country District. Attracted more than 2,500 music lovers. The six hour live concert featured more than 10 independent musicians from Hong Kong, Taiwan, and the mainland to call for the renaissance of cultural development. On Saturday afternoon, people who are fond of independent music and golden melodies gathered in West Kowloon Cultural District Authority for the musical festival hosted by Renaissance Foundation. The admission is open to general public for free online registration in order to call for awakens of cultural development. The live concert began at 3 p.m. featured Hong Kong independent artist Chad Lam. Mainland singer Zhou Yunpeng and folk songwriter Xiao He. Participants were mostly music lovers. Some said they are not satisfied with nowadays rat music industry. Independent musicians who are overlooked by markets have been long seeking for an open platform to perform their works in public, and this festival just meets their needs. And this is where the Renaissance Foundation's outside musical festival take place. It's already 6 40 p.m. and more and more people are still coming this way. The foundation said more than 2,500 visitors come here today. As the night is approaching, people are getting more and more excited. Having beer and hot dogs with friends while listening to music, it brings a new experience to the young people of Hong Kong. Hong Kong. This festival is the first ever large-scale public event organized by the newly established Non-Government Renaissance Foundation. The foundation promises to fund and groom independent art projects in the region. Around 7 p.m., the concert reached a climax. Taiwanese singer and songwriter, Golden Melody Awards winner, Sandy Chen appeared on the stage. After Sandy, mainland rock musician and artist Zuo Xiao Zu Zhou, who has written music for the work of artist Ai Weiwei, sang several songs that reflected some sensitive issues. Hong Kong singer and also the chairman of the foundation, Anthony Wang, came for the grand final show. Scholars believe cultural intrusion from mainland and other regions will squeeze the living space of local culture. The gr growing influence of China and its soft power had a very profound impact on the ecology of Asian cultural industries. More and more the, uh, attention has been diverted to the mainland due to the enormous potentials of the mar uh, mainland market. Hong Kong culture has thus been shrinking significantly over the past decade or so. Uh, Hong Kong candle pop, for instance, had been taken over by Mandel pop. Though it was raining heavily, the people enjoyed the concert to the very last moment.
The concert ends at 11:30 with a resonance from both upper and down stage. Julie, Audrey, Cici, BNN News. That's all for the news. Thanks for joining us.